Iran and the United States came to an agreement. Okay, uh, each side released five prisoners, and Iran actually, uh, in addition to uh, to that, received six billion dollars of its own money. Right, which is a fact that seems to escape every single you know anti-Iranian moron uh, on cable news. So. Uh, this is money that was in Korea, you know, basically, this is money that Iran made selling uh, uh, petroleum, and uh, the United States stole it. The United States held it hostage. And this is very funny, because the, the way that they speak now is that, oh, well, you're rewarding Iran for, uh, for releasing American hostages. No. No, uh, no one is rewarding Iran. You, you should be ashamed to even bring up the money. You know, if I stole six billion dollars from someone and hid them away for, you know, uh, several years and then had to give it back, I would never even mention this. How shame, like shameless do you have to be to talk about it like as if you're doing Iran a favor? You're not doing them a favor. Shame on you. That's not your money. You stole somebody's money. You stole six billion dollars. Basically, this is this is what happened. They, they used Qatar as the um, uh, point of exchange. Uh, and so you had uh, five Americans that were released. They're actually, um, uh, I think um, many of them are dual citizens, right? They're both Iranian and American out of the five uh, that were released. They, they got on a plane uh, from Tehran to Doha, and then from uh, Qatar they went to the United States. And then uh, the United States in exchange, as I said, released the money and also released five Iranian prisoners. I think only two of them went back to Iran for some reason. I don't, I don't know the details of that. I mean, uh, we should get clear on this. A lot of the same people who are running the Biden foreign policy also ran Obama's foreign policy and they want a deal with Iran. They're willing to do just about anything. Here we have them giving away prisoners, giving them six billion dollars. I mean, come on. No, they don't. I'm, they, they don't. Man, I'm one of the only people covering the nuclear deal on the ground. And I'm telling you, they don't want a deal. It's dead. It's actually dead. This is money from oil and gas sales that Iran did with, with, South, with uh, South Korea. And five uh, American prisoners and five Iranian prisoners that have nothing, nothing to do with nuclear physics, with nuclear weapons, with any weapons, with anything. What does this have to do with that? This, is, this has nothing to do with the nuclear deal.